guys, I'm here with a Onceable unboxing for you today. So I ordered a Onceable box probably uh, about two months ago. I got it. I didn't really care for any of the items in there, so I didn't do a video about it. I ended up keeping the um, earrings that I'm wearing. They're kind of a little tropical leaf. Um, they're gold and they're by Euro Collections. Um, so I did keep those so that I wouldn't lose my styling fee. And then Onceable actually reached out to me and asked if I would be willing to try another style edit on them. So of course I said yes, and that's what this box is. So here's the little bundle all nicely wrapped. Inside the little bundle, you have a little envelope to return anything you don't want. Um, there is a little explanation of how to mail it back. You can do UPS or the United States Postal Service. And then the little label is there for you. And then there's a little explanation of all of your items. So if you end up keeping five or more items, you will save 20%. Um, so it says my merchandise total is $380. If I keep five items, I will get a discount of $76, um, which would bring it down to $304 minus my $20 style credit. Um, and then they also gave me a $10 credit because my order was delayed. So if I kept everything in this box, it would be $274. So now I'll go through the items. First little item is a floral long sleeve dress. This is by Skies Are Blue. The sleeves are sheer and they have uh, elastic at the wrist. There's elastic at the waist and then it has kind of a little ruffle on the hem and it is lined. Oh, there's a little packet here. It looks like I got some jewelry. Oh, these are pretty. They're a little beaded. They're a little, um, let me show you the one without the tag. They're gold and they're a little beaded gold hoop earring. I think I requested these on my little style swipe edit um, feed that Wantable has. So I'm trying those on. Next up, I have a pair of jean shorts. They're little cutoff shorts, and they are by Liverpool. And they're pretty soft. They have a little bit of stretch, and they are called the short. So, I do have another pair of Liverpool jean, um, or not jean shorts, but they're kind of like a olive green little twill shorts that fit really nicely, so hopefully those will fit well. Next up, I have a burgundy floral top. This is by the brand West Key. It's kind of a sheer uh, polyester type fabric. And then it looks like it has three quarter length sleeves that have the elastic on the sleeve. Next up, I have a little tank top. This is by Project Social Tea, Los Angeles. It says, chippin', dippin', and margarita sippin'. <laughs> Would be a cute little summer uh, tank top. I also requested that, I think, on my feed. The only thing that I'm not too keen about is it's already very worn. I don't know if you can see, but the hem, or actually the armholes, are 
have little holes in them. And around the neckline too, it's the same. It's just kind of frayed. So we'll see how much that one is. Next item, I have a gray short sleeve top. Just like a simple little t-shirt. It's by Wearables. And then last item are some dark wash jeans by Vervet Los Angeles. I've not heard of this brand, uh, but they're just plain, a little bit of distressing. They have a lot of stretch and the hem is kind of a little frayed hem, but it, it is does have a seam there. And then here's the back. Now to try everything on. So here is the first outfit. I have on the floral woven Henley top in wine by West Key and it is $58. It is super cute. I like the flowers. I like the color. Um, it's pretty um, flowy, I guess I would describe it. It's not really super baggy. Um, I think it fits pretty well. Um, the only thing that's slightly concerning is the elastic here on the sleeves is super tight. Um, and I have pretty small arms, so I think it would be tight on pretty much anybody. Um, but it's a cute top. Um, next I have on the Mid-Rise Ankle Skinny in dark blue by the brand Vervet, and they are $58. They are stretchy, I like the wash. Um, not a huge fan of the hole in the knee here, um, but they're cute if you like uh, that in your jeans, and they fit pretty nicely. I'm going to come a little closer so you can see the earrings. They are the Athena Earring in Labradite by Nakamole, and they are $42. So they are super cute. I like the... Um, all the different colors of beads on them and yeah I think out of these three items I would probably keep the earrings let me know what you guys think so the only thing that I changed was my top I have on the charity tea basalt pigment and it is by Lily Mason by wearables it is $38 it has a little twist here in the front and it fits pretty nicely the fabric is nice and light breathable for summer um, let me know what you guys think I usually don't buy shirts that have a little twist here at the front just because um, I think it kind of makes you look a little pregnant but it's cute facing the front anyway <laughs> um, all right on to the next outfit so this is the v-neck long sleeve dress in navy floral it is by Skies or Blue and it is $68. I don't know about this dress. It is, I think, kind of an in style maybe right now with the little ruffles and the gathering. Um, I don't particularly like this on me, but maybe I'll look back at the video and think something different. I'm not sure. Let me know what you guys think about the dress. I don't know. It's kind of reminds me of Little House on the Prairie slash Cowgirl. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below. So this is the last outfit I have on the Margarita Sip and Tank in Vanilla by Project Social Tea and it is $48. I like the relaxed fit of it. The only thing I don't like is, like I mentioned before, the little frayed neckline and the frayed armholes. Also, I don't know if you can tell, but it kind of pokes out at the armholes on either side. So I'm not going to be keeping the tank. The shorts are the Vicky Frey Hem Shorts in Arizona. They are by Liverpool and they are $68. Liverpool is a little bit of a more expensive brand. 
Um, I like the front. I like the little faded look and the frayed hem. Um, I don't really like them from the back. So they do have a little notch here on the side, which I think is cute. Um, but they really look the best from the front and they don't look really good from the back in my opinion. Um, so I will probably end up keeping the earrings with all my credits. I will be able to get the earrings for about $12, which is not bad for earrings at all. So let me know what you guys thought about this Wantable box. If you think I should continue getting Wantables, let me know in the comments below. Also, if you like my makeup, I will link it in the description box below for you, all the colors that I used. Um, most everything that I'm wearing is Mary Kay, and I also sell Mary Kay. So I will see you guys in the next video.